Hi, I'm Bill the Piano Tuner. Thanks for joining me today. What we've been talking about is the parts of a piano action and how they respond to the travel of the key. Now I'd like you to come and take a close look at what we're dealing with today. We've already discussed the, the butt flange, the butt, the hammer shank, and the hammer. What we want to talk today about is the uh, catcher shank and the catcher. The catcher has this little leather glued to it. Now the parts on the whip, whipping, this is the whipping, this is the back check wire and the back check. Now it's funny they call this the catcher but it's actually being caught by the back check. It's just nomenclature that's kind of funny. Now when you strike the key the hammer strike goes up, hits the string and releases and you see that the catcher is being caught or checked by the back check. See that? Now, usually, the distance that the, the hammer is caught from the string is 5 eighths. And then when you release the key, it lets the hammer, the butt come all the way back to reset to play again. And that's what I have for you today. Thanks for joining me again. Have a wonderful day. I'm off to Doylestown to tune a piano where I'll be perfecting each note one key at a time. Bye-bye.